Donnie. Dog, dog. <laughs> All right, now. Think about it, man. First of all, let me start this. Yo, let's, I, ra- I, I let's, hate- let's rate it first. What do you guys rate it out of 10? <sighs> let's do that. Five. Six. I got it at a seven. I got that junk at an eight point, <laughs> eight point five. All right. I, so I, I, I might bring it back down. I might bring it to an eight. Now, I'm gonna just say an eight. I'm, I'm just let me let me speak my piece because yeah, I'm not. Yeah, yeah, get it all eight. out. Get it all I out. I hate the fact. I hate. I hate. I hate. I hate that he his mother's name is Donna, and he made that stupid ass chant at the beginning of it to make every person that has a fucking brain hate his mother's name. I hate. It. I hate. Everybody, I never want to hear that song again. Everybody I never want to hear that name again. Yeah, I hate okay. that name. I hate it. I hate it. It's fucking stupid. It's Just dumb. talk for yourself, yo. Jesus, Jesus. I, I did. I, I, you said I did. everybody. I said you said everybody. Okay, there's a lot of other people in the internet world. Yeah, but who you say don't know them. That shit's stupid. You don't know them. I do. What the fuck you mean? We got comments. We got comments and people commenting on everything. Who said? Mad that? people don't like this album. Yeah, I know. I know. Mad people hate the fact that it starts off with that Don check. Yeah, because it, it makes y'all feel uncomfortable. It make everybody feel uncomfortable. What what purpose does it serve for me to hear to, to chant Donda? It ain't, it ain't no purpose for you. It's because he wanted to do it. Yeah, this is this is mom. I feel you, but what the fuck am I doing it for? Why do I want to hear that over and over and over and over and over and over and over? I ain't so saying, I'm ready. not saying you want to hear it. I'm just saying <laughs> he wanted to put it there. No, what I'm saying is, what are you disputing? Though, when you say speak for myself. You keep saying you everybody. You keep saying everybody. I don't have a problem hearing it. That's what I'm saying. I don't have a so problem. You just sit there it. and listen to it through. Yeah, I press play. I listen to the whole album through. What I'm saying is, you're gonna go back and listen to it again. You're gonna start oh, in track one and oh, listen to Donda. No, no, it's not oh, a song. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. So it I'm served not. no purpose. I'm not doing that. I'm, I'm right. just saying I don't hate it. You saying you saying you hate this, and I'm saying I don't hate it. Speak for yourself. Okay, so that's what I'm eight saying. is such a. I guess. I guess. Okay, so I guess we, it's 2021. So we have to actually use words that are actually like. Okay, so I don't hate hate it. It's I'm not saying that I, if like, you I, hate it, I don't. You hate, hate it. Anything. I'm just saying I don't. I, it's hate. not a lot of things that I hate. I dislike the fact that that nigga has that chant in the beginning of it. Me and my whole family listened to this drunk and was like, "Nigga, turn this shit off." What are you talking? It made me not even want to listen to the album. Why? Because a just too cult like like for me. It's 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 not it's not comfortable. Yeah, it's it's definitely uncomfortable. And it serves no purpose. I could be listening to an audiobook. You understand? What I, mean? I could be listening to a, a song directing it to my lady or a song with my kids and stuff. I could be listening to something with my ears <laughs> and my brain. More than that. It don't have me do all this fucking anticipation for me to hear you say this chanting name like you the fucking devil, like we worshiping the devil for a whole two minutes for nothing. For nothing at all. It's stupid. It's a waste of my fucking time. I okay, think, get to the I, album. Get to the album. Oh, yeah, go ahead. You can that, keep talking. Not, yeah, keep talking. Yeah, get to the album. Okay, what you so don't the like album, the reason, why, reason why I didn't rate it a five or a six is because I expect a great album from Kanye West. The things that I expect from Kanye West, I expect. So you don't get no props for what, what you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, what, what you say, who said that? I think you said it. Fish don't fish don't get props for swimming. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's yeah. that's just what it is. But <laughs> once again, just like the last album, I'm never going to listen to this album again. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not, it's not really. A, it's, I'm not going that far. Not, not unless I'm over Brandon's house. <laughs> it's never going to get no replay value on my, on my, on my book. Why? You know what a, I'm saying? It's Damn. a bunch of great songs on there. Yeah. Yeah, but th- yo, listen, listen. There's mad great songs. Prime example. Uh to Pimp a Butterfly was a great album. Stupid album. Right? Okay. But when it first came on, it didn't have a bunch of replay value to me. You know what I'm saying? Don't take it away from that junk was one, one of the most artistic albums ever. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Okay. It's just the fact that it just don't have that replay value to me. T- and even so, when the it never did. It never came back. But I do hear certain songs from the Butterfly where I'd be like, "Woo!" You know what I'm saying? But it still don't have no replay value. I ain't go back like, "Oh, let me." 
And that's how I just feel about Kanye West music at this point in time. There's Kanye West albums that have way more replay value. They still have replay value to this day. None, none of these gospel albums do. You know what I'm saying? And it's not that they're not good albums. They just, A, I don't, I, well, I, I don't, you know what I'm saying? I don't really rock with the cult like shit. Or I, I'm not going to the shows. I'm not, I don't even want to watch the shows. This shit look too demonic for me. You know what, mm-hmm. what I'm saying? That's just me personally. It just looked demonic as fuck. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and I'm old school and I'm in my ways and I'm not fucking with it. You know what I'm saying? So, but as far as listen to the music, of course, nigga, I'm with that. that. That's different than you burning churches and shit. Like, eh. <laughs> like, that, wasn't, that wasn't a I, church. Cool. Huh? Well, that, that wasn't his, that wasn't a church, but go ahead. Either way, <laughs> either way, you get, I mean, you that's get, two different things. You like, get the drift of what I'm saying, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? The gist of what I'm saying. At the end of the day, great album. Not even though it's a five or a six for the record, none of you other niggas can put out an album. <laughs> Never. That's for the record. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not taking away from this nigga still a genius. And his marketing is fucking retarded. <laughs> the rollout, oh, yeah. the best Crazy. rollout ever. Ever created. Best rollout ever created. And even the market on the album, you have to listen to the album to see the features. He mm. got everybody you want to hear. He got that you from... You don't even know who he got. Don't got the credits he, or none of them. He got that from... Um, he got that from... Um, what's his name? Uh, what's that nigga name? Yeah. Uh, uh, what's that nigga name? Travis Scott. He did... Travis Scott did that last time. Mm. Um, with... Um, with uh, the circus one, the circus album. Yo, this nigga said, this one nigga said, uh, I read the comments. This one nigga junk, he said, that junk sound like a, a DJ Khaled, <laughs> DJ Khaled gospel album <laughs> featuring Kanye <laughs> on every song. Yeah. Go ahead, Mike. All right. That's my take. All right, all right, all right. Listen here. I gave it a 7.5. Well, I say 7.5 now because I'm I'm thinking about it. And I think the, the most important thing we got to ask ourselves is, have we really digested this album? Is it just a one listen and then, oh, I know everything about it. I get every song. And, da, 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 and we're giving it these, these numbers. Because I have a feeling that your number's going to change. And so is mine. I, gar- I guarantee it. I guarantee it. I'm calling it now. So just to debate this, just to debate this, because I hear a lot of people say stuff like this. I'm just saying. Uh, maybe, maybe I'm just a weirdo. But maybe. I never... I'm lying. Oh my God. <laughs> you- I just recently did it. I recently just did it with Wale. He's oh, my first yes. example. He's you my first example. You definitely cleaned that-, that up. You definitely cleaned that up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I, 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 before Wale, then I would have said, yo, once I hear you, my nigga, I don't, ah, I'm not. Nah. But for the record, that's just, that's just, but I, I, it's, it's I mean, very, very rare. Everybody's different, but I'm just saying. It's very, very rare that I hear an album. And I'll be like, yo, this nigga trash. And then I go back and be like, nah, this drug actually got hard. It usually be like, it has to be like a, uh, yo, this this drug is I. There's some joints that's bangers. You know what I'm saying? To make me listen to the joint. And then when I hear somebody else, or I, I run across it again and be like, all right, yo, this drug got a little bop to it. Or if they start uh, brainwashing me with the radio or something, it's different. You feel oh, what I'm saying? It's but, coming. It's coming. Right, right, right. Other than that, coming. This trash is trash, my nigga. I don't think I don't think he got something that's gonna. Be, well, maybe. Um, Kanye West is never gonna put up trash. Maybe that joint with um, Young Thug, maybe radio. That joint with him and Young Thug on remote control. Mm. Yo, he, yo, the dog on um him him and little baby niggas on space jam. Who and little baby? Kanye West. Oh no, that's Kirk Franklin. Yeah, that's Kirk yeah, Franklin. Yeah, I'm about to say. Yeah, that's Kirk Franklin. Wrong gospel artist. Nigga going yeah. sick. I mean, hey. Yo, little baby eating up everything. Even up. Even, even I'm jerks, almost even ready to give him his flowers. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, oh, I was, yo, oh. I was, yo, <laughs> I was listening. I was like, yo, hold up, hold up, one yo, second. Yo, man, I'm almost I'm ready. I ain't, I ain't jumping. Baby. I ain't jumping out the window yet. But I, I've, I'm, I'm watching. I'm watching. What else he gotta do? This nigga yeah. gotta do a song. He gotta do a song with Donald Trump. That nigga oh. Brandon, yo. 
Alright, that nigga is dumb. <laughs> <laughs>